Oh, he's the real anointed one. <laughs> Have the anointed one. Oh, it is awesome, awesome to be in the house of God. There are truly no words to describe how awesome the Lord is, even in the darkest moments. Uh, darkest times in your life, he doesn't change. And he is just yes. as beautiful yes. and the light as he is when the darkness tries to come and take yes. you out. Yes. The light and the beauty of who he is. You still... can have a less anointed one back. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh, no. Honey, we are equal, remember? That's right. Yeah, yeah nice. Yeah. Lord, we are. <laughs> oh, but this to know how much the Lord truly loves you. And is I, we cannot thank you enough that I'm telling you, every one of your prayers truly pulled us out of the pit of hell because it was trying really hard to take us out. But God, yeah. but God, but God, but God, but God, will only be the one to have the last word over Amen. our Amen. life. Amen. here to do yes. for his kingdom. Yes. And every one of you are all included. Yes. All of you. And we're here still because of you. Because of every prayers that bombarded heaven. And God said, not now. As you can see, not now. Today is not the day, Satan. No longer, no longer, no longer shall he rule and reign, though he'll try. That's right. He'll try. try. But he will not succeed. That's right. Because Amen. God is truly on your side. Amen. Yes. And when you walk through that, and I can tell you there were days I didn't walk. I just could lay there in it because I didn't have enough strength to get up and walk. Mm. But the prayers of the saints, God. they came forth. Truly, 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 the church became one during this time. But it's not just this time does God call us to become one. one. He's calling the church to be one all the time. And it doesn't matter what you face, what you're going through, what's coming against you, what's trying to take you out. When God says, arise, church, he says it for a reason. Arise into what he's called you to do. There is a calling and gifts 
and, and talents in every single one of you. And he wants to awaken them today on Pentecost Sunday. Amen. Why am it's I here again? Day. Yeah, I'm, <laughs> she's kind of just to confirm. That's the prophet is the confirmation here. Hallelujah. Oh, but we are ready to worship the Lord. I'm so excited to be in the house of God. I'm, woo, three weeks. I said, Lord, I felt like Daniel the Lion. Yeah. 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 I said, three weeks today. Hallelujah. Ooh. Look what God did in three weeks for yes, Daniel. Yeah. Hallelujah. So, Amen. Lord, we come before you, ready to just go after you. Oh, my goodness. We have such anticipation, expecting the unexpected today. In every way, in every way, in every way, we move ourselves out of the way so that only you, Holy Spirit, can come in here with a mighty rushing wind and blow in this place. Oh, thank you for the fire of God. Come upon this place and ignite every single one of us in a new way.